being attacked and basically told that we're not welcome in our own country. And Rocio's piece, uh, Once Upon a Time from Laca, um, if you'd like to talk about that. It's an, it's an amazing piece and we're so proud to feature it. And Rocio Diaz is our associate producer and uh, she's been with uh, Chicanas Cholas y Chisme for about four years on and off. The writer of Once Upon a Time on that guy. And the reason I wrote my piece and the reason why these pieces are very important are it's important because it's women's voices and it's the reality that women face every day. And their mothers, it's generational. And um, I think the timing is perfect given everything that's going on in the country. We have a president who's accused of being a sexual predator, abusing his power over women to silence them. This play is very important to me because. A lot of times, especially now in society, a lot of issues aren't talked about when it comes from a woman's perspective and also how the system has been structured in order to be able to either delegitimize, devalue and oppress those uh, perspectives and voices and being able to contribute into what's going on with society right now. Important because it's about the truth. It's about what we don't tell. It's about what is happening all the time with society, with cultural things, with, with, with uh, everything that belongs to, to humans and never talk about it because it's about those moments that we just want to swallow and pretend they're not there. As women, we're not always allowed to take space in society. You know, a lot of the time we're, we're told to be quiet about certain things uh, such as rape, such as being harassed in the workplace, such as being called derogatory names in the workplace just because you stand up for yourself or because you want to lead. You know, and, that, and that's why these plays are so important because we're allowed to take space in the theater, on paper, as producers, as actors, and um, as stars of the show. You know, the women really went ahead and told very personal stories, but also, you know, issues that are very, very important to, to women and have always been. I wish you never been born. I didn't ask to be born. You should have just let me die when I was a baby. I hate my life. Anyway. Reporting for Collegian Wired, I'm Dave Martin.